Hey guys, welcome back to Curvy Try. So today I'm not wearing any eyeliner or mascara because I am trying a product that has been requested for a very long time, the Moxie Lash Magnetic Eyeliner. This sounds way too good to be true. It is a liner that includes magnetic powder so that your magnetic lashes adhere to your eyeliner. So. What is Moxie Lash? There are a lot of benefits to it, according to their website. It can be used with other magnetic lash products. It's windproof. There's over 100 uses with the liner. It's supposed to lock the lashes into place. They sell the liner individually with a brush. And don't worry, it is FDA approved. It's cruelty free. There's a 30 day money back guarantee. And the only downside is it only ships to the United States and Canada right now. It retails for $32. I would say it's definitely a beauty investment, if you will. You can also buy a bundle with a pair of the Moxie Lash eyelashes. These little babies, there's different styles, but we got these. That bundle is $75. I guess it's because they're reusable, right? I mean, I'm an Ardell girl. I love my Ardell lashes. I have tried magnetic lashes in the past. And when I did, you guys might remember, I didn't like the magnetic lashes because I felt like I had more control using glue. But I realized that I am allergic to latex glue. So I switched to a latex free glue and I've been fine ever since. But now I'm even more intrigued by this particular eyeliner because it might make me like magnetic lashes now. Why don't we get to trying this out? Let's do it. Basically, you just apply your eyeliner normally. So I have on my base, my foundation, contour, all that stuff. I have on eyeshadow and my brows. And now I'm just gonna apply my eyeliner like I normally would. I have a little bit of like a hooded mono lid. And so I have to get like really, really in there on my lash line. I don't even have to close my eyes to do this because my eyelid is, this is my eyelid, man. I don't think it's that black. I don't think it's as intensely pigmented as they claim it to be. So I don't want you guys to buy this and think that you're gonna get this majorly deep onyx shade of black. So I have on the liner. Now I'm gonna, this is supposed to be really simple. I'm supposed to take the lash and just pop it right on my eye. Oh, it's working. I feel it. Oh shoot. Although I just feel like the lashes are a little too curly. Hold on guys, let me. They look kind of crazy, right? Honestly, I just feel like the hairs are kind of going everywhere, and it does look like I have some sparse spots. Eyeliner, ding, works. It works, it's staying. This is impressive, I'm impressed. I am not impressed by the actual lash. The good news is that even though I don't like these lashes, I brought the One Two Cosmetics lash. This is for the top left, so let me see if I can remember how to do this. Top left. Place it there. I, this is the same problem that I had with the magnetic lashes before. I can't place them in a way that looks natural. Like I don't have as much control over them. Okay, so I have been told that apparently this looks good on camera. I don't know, I can't see a monitor, but in person I was like, okay, y'all have to come over here and see me in person. And they're like, oh yeah, you look crazy. Cause it's like dangling off of the side of my eye. <laughs> All right, so I did this eye with Bobbi Brown's gel liner. I just wanted something a little bit deeper for my eyeliner. And also because I was noticing that the magnets were wanting to cling to the actual wing and not my lash line, we figured it's probably better do your liner as normal and then add a little bit of this gel liner, the magnetic gel liner to your lash line. So that's what I'm gonna do right now. Okay, so I'm just gonna go right over my lash line. Brush, brush, brush. Let's put on these two little babies. Just gonna blend. I don't hate that. I don't hate that. Okay, verdict time. Let's recount everything. So use your favorite gel liner or liquid liner, apply the magnetic liner just on your lash line, and then apply whatever favorite magnetic eyelash that you have, and you should be good to go. And then of course, blend with mascara. In terms of the Moxie Lash Magnetic Eyeliner, I'm going to give it a five. 
Yay, five Kirby's, woo! It works, it does what it says it does. I think that it's so gratifying just watching that lash adhere to your lash line without glue getting everywhere. A plus, good job on the magnetic eyeliner. In terms of the magnetic lashes, I still want someone to perfect magnetic lashes. I want a good quality lash that will curve with your eye shape. Make these little individual sizes, guys, these little babies right here, and put two little tiny, two little tiny magnets right there, okay? So then when it adheres, it actually will curve to your lash line. And that is my free idea for you. Make millions of dollars off of me. Okay guys, that is the end of this episode of Kirby Tries. What did you think? Have you tried the Moxie Lash Magnetic Eyeliner? If so, let me know in the comments and let me know what your tips and tricks are. As always, you can follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Kirby Johnson and on Facebook at Kirby Johnson TV. Please be sure to follow and subscribe to Freeform so you can get more Kirby Tries. And we'll see you next time. Bye.